Hey everybody, it's Phil Evans with Keller Williams Realty, and today I want to talk about how your monthly mortgage payments are affected every time the interest rates increase. I had a client the other day ask me, should they wait until next year if the market continues to soften, um, maybe it's a better idea to buy later. Well, here's basically how it breaks down. Uh, every time there's a 1% increase in interest rates, it means basically there's a 10% increase in your monthly mortgage payments. Now, as we know, interest rates are not increased by 1% every time they're done by a quarter percent. And so what that basically means is about a 2.5% increase in your monthly mortgage costs. Now that can seem like it's not very much, but if you look at the costs of a mortgage, you can see here, which in the Bay area, a typical uh, mortgage can easily be four to $5,000 per month. Um, it can rack up, very quickly. Also, remember, this is just for every three months, every time that the Fed wants to raise the interest rates, which has generally been every three months, um, then you need to double that number, essentially. Um, so if you are in a, uh, let's say, a $4,000 a month mortgage price range, all of a sudden you wait six months to find a home and you could be paying uh, $2,400 more a year or $200 more a month just because interest rates have possibly risen twice, which they're expected to do. Uh, they have three times this last year and they're we're expected to do at least two or three uh, more times this next year. So that's how the numbers break down. So the answer is, should I wait and see if the market softens more and I can get the house for less in the new year? Um, my answer is no. And the reason why is because even if um, the price of the property goes down, we don't expect it to go down 2.5% in the next three months, uh, and certainly not 5% in the next six months in value, uh, which it would have to do for you to break even to buy the home now um, if the costs are a little higher. I hope that makes sense. If it doesn't, give me a call. I'll explain a little better to you. Uh, but essentially, as interest rates go up 2.5% every three months, or your cost of buying the home goes up 2.5% every three months, the, the value of the home would have to drop 2.5% every three months for you to break even. Okay, so it's always better, at least in my area in San Mateo County, to always buy sooner than later. We have a great uh, increase of values in homes in the Bay Area. And so the sooner you can get in, the lower the interest rate, the more time you have of owning that property while it, the value increases, um, the better. So if you have any questions on that, if you're ready to start your home search uh, or if you need any other information, please don't hesitate to reach out. You can always reach me at philevans at kw.com or 650-503-3694. Hope you guys are having a great week and we'll talk to you soon.